formation of seed and food is our topic for today. This takes place after fertilization. This is Teacher Jeffrey. Want to find out more about plant reproduction? Come on, dive in and let us begin. After fertilization, the fertilized ovule will become the seed and the ovary will become the fruit. If you are asked what will happen to the rest of the flower, as the fruit and the seed are formed, the petals, sepal, style, stigma, filament, and anther will wither out. So it means they will dry and they will fall to the ground. Try to answer this question. Where does the seed come from? Second, where does the fruit come from? And third, what will happen to the rest of the flower after the formation of the seed and the fruit? Now it's time to answer. So the first, where does the seed come from? It is coming from the ovule because it is where fertilization occurs. Number two, where does the fruit come from? So the ovary as the outer part of the ovule will become the fruit. So it is the ovary that becomes the fruit. And lastly, what will happen to the rest of the flower after formation of the seed and the fruit? They will wither out so they will become dry and will fall to the ground. This ends another stage of plant reproduction, formation of seed and fruit. We will discuss in our next video dispersal of seed. This is Teacher Jeffrey. A goal without a plan is just a wish.